Hello everybody, this is Naomi. I have a haul that from a rubber sale that I went to over the weekend. And in this sale, I found a bunch of lace and ribbon. And for everything that I bought, I paid $4 for. And I, I am just totally blown away. I couldn't believe I had found all this stuff. So I want to do a quick, small, well, it's not a small, <laughs> a, a, a tutorial for you on it and show you what I got. Okay, starting off with is all of these ribbons here. And there's quite a bit on the spool, as you see. There's all of these colors. There's all of these from thin ribbon on up to the, you know, wider and then wider. And then I have this. All different colors, all different designs. Um, let's see, here's some more ribbon. Excuse me. There's that, and then they have the real wide ribbon, satiny color here. Then I found some of the old pom-pom. This was all, I got a trash bag size, it's a kitchen trash bag size, full. And I paid three dollars for it and then two bags of other things for 50 cents a piece. And then I found these was in it. Let's see, it's got the Excuse me. And then this, uh, some of this is very old. And then here's some more of the little pom pom trim. I can't wait to get in the. And then here's some more lace, which is the probably two inch lace. But this, I mean, it's not the typical lace. It's. See how it is? So there's that one. And then the next one. It's similar to it, but it's not the same pattern. And it's got a different wave in it. So there's that one. Then there's this one that's probably every bit of two and a half to three inches wide. It's a kind of a orange red, kind of a gold, you know, that type of color. And there's there's quite a bit here. So there's that. Then you have all of these. Different. Then this was what I thought was pretty neat. Look at this. Hey, isn't that pretty? And I even got some material. It's the fabric. Um, kind of the velvet material and some uh, silk uh, material and then this I got this in all different textures and styles and so there's that and then I got a, it's a brand new bag it's a kind of a gold colored pom-poms. 
see if I can undo this real quick. That way you can see how it is. Get this. There you go. There you can see what it looks like. But that's, it's five and a half yards. When she originally bought it, I guess she paid $2.50. So right there alone was almost what I paid for all of this together. So I think I did pretty good. So, and then I have a purple in this. Here is the purple. Isn't that pretty? See, it's the same way as... Actually, this is the back side. It would go more like this. There we go. Isn't that pretty? I cannot wait. I was out of a lot of my lace and ribbon and I was really needing it so this really come in handy. And then you've got all of these different colored laces. Then you have all of these laces. Very pretty. So, and if you hear some thunder, and we're kind of getting a little bit of a storm going on right now. So, then I got these different kinds of shag and streamer and there's that one and then there's this one I mean it's just yeah it is so yeah I mean I've got container after container after containers of this. I mean, here's one of the Dollar Tree containers. These were all in it. There's two deals of ribbon. They were 99 cents a piece. Brand new rows, never been opened. Here's a third. It's had some taken off of it. And then you have all of these and you have all of these and you got this one which has a neat little pattern on it here's another one that I thought was pretty neat There's quite a bit of that there. And here's this roll. And this is a sequin stretchy elastic kind. And there's some blue, some brand new purples, some brand new blues that's never been used or open. Here's a roll of the, the little pearls pearls and then here's a floral um, then here's some black lace gold and green and red and here's this it's never been opened and you have some black and some red I mean So that's one container. Here's container number two. And as you see, it's it's full. 
So here's container number two. It's a gray with a silver line, uh, strip in the center. There's that one. And then there's this one. Then there's this one. And this is the zigzag one. I forget what you call it. See? All of these here are that. And then this is just a kind of a, um, a braided cord there. And then there's these flowers and these and all different kinds. For four dollars, I don't think I did bad. And like I said, they're, they're pretty thick rolls. Then there's that. Then there's these. And like I said, a lot of these, I know they're older than Methuselah, but whether it be old or not, it's still going to work. Not pretty. It's a pretty blue. Then you have some yellow ones. You got two different size yellows. And these are some kitty prints. You got elephants and a hippo, a giraffe, a lion. There's that. And then this one's kind of Christmassy. Tip that back just a little. There we go. Trying to stay in scene where everybody can see. And here's this one. Then you have this one. This one don't have a lot on it, but it'll be good for a small project. Here's this one. Then you have these two that have never been opened. Can't really see the pattern of it, but they've never been opened. They're brand new. Then you have this one, and this is a velvety cord. This one's a velvet. And then you have this one. And you have this one. And then you have some of this. I want to say it's kind of like tool, but not tool. Um, Oh, I forget what you call it. But anyways. Roll that back up. And then you have this one. And then you have these little butterfly, other flower pieces. And this, I want to say, has come off of a shirt or a blouse or something. But there's four or five pieces of that, so. Okay, let me get all this put back in the little tote. So I can show you some more. Okay. There's that one. Okay. Then we have... This one, and see this, isn't that pretty? And it's got a little bit of stretch, not much, but I think that will be just gorgeous to use on a project. So there's that, and then here's a white one. Different pattern. Then you have this roll of ribbon. So there's that. Let me get this roll back out real quick. There's that. And then here's this one. There's 
that. And then there's two spools of this. Okay. And then there's a darker spool of that. Then you have this beautiful purple. Isn't that gorgeous? Okay, and then you have this kind of, it's a black and silver, I want to say a twine. There's quite a bit of that there. And then this lace here. And there's quite a bit there. And then here's some more of those little balls. And then there's two rows of this lace. And then from here on out, it's just, it's little pieces of lace. That's got quite a bit. There's a little bit. And this, I'm not really sure what it is, but the design on it is pretty cool looking. I don't know if you can see it. I mean, it stands up. Okay. I'm just going to dump these out, and that way whenever I show them to you, I can put them back in the container. There's some yellow. There's some dark blue. That's a peach. That's a black. There's that one. Oops. There's that one. You can tell that's old. So, and there's a peach color. Like I said, some of them not got a lot to it, but if you needed it just to do on a small project, a small piece of it, it would give you that. Okay, let me get this back in here and we'll show you some more. Okay, there's that tote. And then we have this one. And... This is a big old roll, excuse me, the mat moved, of uh, black lace. Isn't that pretty? Look at the flowers. And like I said, that is a big roll. I'll tell, <laughs> there's my hand, that's how big the roll is. There's that one. And then here's this black. And I was totally out of the black. This could be to be a sink. Use it as one. Or you can split it down the middle and use it as a single. But I have this one. I have two rows of this. There's that one. And then this small one. And once again, that's... How big the, and then there's this kind of a grayish color, white. Then there's this big old roll of this. And there's another roll of that right there. And then this is another sequin. It's stretchy and it's sequins. And there's some of that wired cord. 
And this is just lace. And there's some fly, uh, red, excuse me. There's some blue and silver. Blue and some white. Some more black. There's some blue. There's some yellow. Flowery color. There's that one. There's a black and white. It's a pink and a blue and a gold and a black. Let me grab these out of here. There's a red. There's a pink. There's a white lace. There's a pink. There's another white, kind of a cream color. There's a white and a pink. A yellow that's kind of got of a bluish tint to it I'll set those back in there and clear these out then you have the thin green the block the thin blue and then you have this pattern And you got some pink and some gold, some more pink, some silver, some red, turquoise blue, there's some more red, there's some gold color, that's a kind of a maroonish color, that's a gold, and this is a green uh, velvet, there's a black, there's a white. Another green, red, and there's that one. Okay, so that's all of this one. Get it back in here. And my next chore is to put all of this away. So, and then there's this huge roll of the blue. And then you have this one with the different laces and this one. And you have, it's a purple cord, like that. And then you got this lace. Then you got this gold. Isn't that pretty? And there's the black one. That way you can see it a little bit better. But there's both of those. And then you have this black. And then you have this black. And you have this pattern, and you have that pattern. Isn't that pretty? So you know those are old. Then you have all of these. The yellow, pink and white. Then you have the flowers. And then this yellow, that blue. Then you have that pink. Almost getting out of weekend. There you go. And then you have that green one. You better, yep, down there. There you go. And then you have this pink one. This blue one. This blue one. And you have this. Yeah. 
Now I'm going to show you all the material that I got and stuff like that. I got this purple, kind of a light blue, kind of a purplish color tool. And it's a pretty good size row, as you can see. So there's that. Then I got this lace. It's a pretty good size piece of lace. Oh, and that's not going to give it justice. Okay. Does that make it any better? There you go. And there's quite a bit of this here, so... So there's that. And then I have this. Let's see if I can get it down to one layer where you can see it. And it's a gold. And there's quite a bit of that here. So there's that. Then I have a black one as well. It is a black and gold. And this is a pretty good size piece too. So. Then I have this pink lace. I want to say whoever was was making something out of it or took it off of something, but there's enough there to make a good project with, so I'm not worried about that. And then there's some more of it in the pink. There's quite, like I said, there's quite a bit. Isn't that pretty? So, I shouldn't need or want for lace for a while. Then, I have a few appliques. I want to say that this was a sleeve or a cuff. Can't really. There we go. Now you can see it. And there's two of those. Then we have this lace. Still doesn't give it justice. But there is a lot of it, so. There's that. Uh, there's some more of that pink. Then I have some of the. And this is like silk or satin. It's in a kind of a cream color. There's that. And then I have it in the pink. And I have more of the pink. I thought this would be pretty like lining the inside cover of a book. So there's that. Then you have this is a sleeve off of a jacket or shirt, but it's all lace. So I figure I'll take it apart and use it on a project. And I've got two of those. 
So there's that. Then I have this lace. That's a pretty good sized piece of it. Then there's another piece of that. So there's two of those. And then here's this one. And then it has the backing, the sheer backing behind it. So you could either use it with it on it or without it. So, it's a good size piece of that. Then, and here, this is another piece of that. So that's two of those. Uh, that's three of those. Then I have, this is that, oh, that blanket type material that you'd make a blanket out of. So there's a decent piece of it. And this is an old fabric. It's got the bow, the cow. Let's see. I could have swore there was a chicken on it. Yep, and a chicken. But that's an old material. So there's that. And then you have this one. Isn't that pretty? And there's a pretty good piece of material there. And then you have this one. And it has just a kind of a polka dot material behind it. So there's that, and then we have a piece of the, the sheer green, and, nope, we have some of the blue, isn't that pretty, and here's another piece of the blue. And we have a piece of the white. And then I thought this one was interesting. Now look at this color. Isn't that pretty? I'm not sure what it was at one time, but it's definitely different. So there's that. And now we're getting into the, oh, there's a different one. Getting into the velvet material that I was telling you about. Isn't that pretty? And it's that velvety texture. I've got it blue. Got quite a bit of the blue. Then I've got it in the black. Isn't that pretty? Then I've got it in a maroon. Kind of a maroon red. Isn't that pretty? And here's some more of that sheerness. And here's another. Isn't that pretty? You could almost just cut out the flower alone and use it as a different type embellishment or something to that effect. But then there's that. And then I've got more of the blue. And I've got kind of a... It's a pink color. And that velvety material. 
And then there's another big piece of the blue. And my last piece that I have is this. Isn't it gorgeous? Let me move some of this out of the way so you can see it a little better. But this is my last and final thing. No, I got one other thing to show. But isn't that pretty? It's got all these beautiful beads. It's hand sewn on it with these beautiful big diamonds clusters okay I got one more small thing to show while we're here and it's right here not a lot okay I got these little envelope pack paper envelope packages and these are a thick paper and there's six of those and I paid 25 cents for those then I found these fall they're the kind of like rosettes but they turn into flowers I got those and I bought these paid a quarter for them they're little flowers and I got this orange ribbon and I got this pink ribbon I shouldn't need the ribbon at all and then there's this with the wire on both sides it says love And it had these pumpkins in it. You can use for fall or Halloween. Then you've got this gray. That's never been open. And you got the stretchy elastic cord. Then you have this roll of pink. And it's still got quite a bit of pink on it so and then there's just some loose white in here not a lot and then this is one of those uh, big rosette decoration fans you can see it it was just thrown in here so and then I got all of this I got this bracelet and I'm going to use it for the beads and then I got this brooch I'm going to use it for crafting. Isn't that pretty? So there's that. And then this one has a kind of combination stuff in it. It has the heart uh, pink and white heart confetti in it. Then it has some little jewels in it. And then it has these three leaf um, there we go beads so there's that there's quite a bit in that bag then I found this bracelet. Isn't that pretty? And I want it for the beads. And then that a pretty gold and 
colored. But there's one necklace and two bracelets, which I bought for the beads. I paid 50 cents. Yeah, 50 cents for, which is not bad. And last thing is this necklace. It has the little gems around it here with the black and then a dangly chain and a very long chain. So that's all for my rummage sale haul. If you like my video, hit the like and subscribe. And I will be back with more videos. Thank you for coming and thank you for watching. Have a good day.